Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome back to another episode of World of Warship. We're gonna be checking out the new rework on the submarine. Apparently they fixed the problem with submarine shotgunning their target at a super close range without anyone being able to detect them. So uh, that is uh, one of the major uh, we worked and as well as adding new upgrades and more buffed up stats so we'll get into that so anyway let's start with the uh, the shotgun uh, issue so I'm using the Gato and well this is a, a modded skin it's not part of our uh, wargaming uh, I got this from Ace Lane so download his uh, its mod to f get the skin I guess and it matches with my flag too, the uh, Manju flag. I think that's what it is, right? It's the Manju skin. Manju, yeah, special flag. Pretty cool that they have a skin for the submarine of Manju. Anyway, so the torpedoes. I don't know if this works for the destroyer, but for the submarine, if you launch this torpedo under three kilometers, it's gonna get a lot weaker. Now, if you launch them or arm them after 3.0 kilometers, then it's gonna fulfill its maximum damage. And how do you know when to launch your torpedo? Uh, you go to the torpedo section and you can see the new stat line that they add maximum damage range 2.9 kilometers so that's where the borderline is for you to get maximum damage for your torpedo and uh what else we have new upgrades um let's see yep so the first one is damage control system modification that's the newest one and you could probably notice by the more enhanced uh, <laughs> icon. Yeah. And then the second one is the Torpedo 2 Modification 3, which gives you plus 7% damage. And the third one is Reinforced uh, Bulkhead, which gives you uh, more armor against the death charges. So negative 15% on that. But I don't, I don't know if it helps you against uh, the main battery shell on the uh, ships. But anyway, um, I don't think there's anything for the uh, six slot. So anyway, with that uh, new up upgrade, Torpedo 2 Modification 3. Is that new? I don't know if that's new. But uh, they did increase my damage so you can see that my uh, homing torpedo uh, maximum damage was 7800 now it's been improved to 10,700 so about close to a three quarter of an extra boost and same goes to my alternative torpedo I, I used to have a maximum damage of 20,000 now with the upgrade I got 22 thousand one hundred forty nine damage it's uh pretty crazy you know that you made the submarine more stronger or to just take away one kilometer of uh shotgunning <laughs> that's what it is so you so you sacrifice one kilometer from shotgunning a ship and then they give you this upgrade boost <laughs> And what else they have? They have a uh, a new uh, rework on the hydrophones, so it's no longer having 10 or 12 second action time, it's one second. So it just reveals the ship's location, that's about it. It'll point out on the map, so it's kind of like RPF in a way. Uh, for the uh, Thrasher, well you get charges so but the cooldown is 25 seconds 
or 25.5 compared to the unlimited one which is uh 51 seconds uh, so yeah that's uh pretty much it uh we do have a new function key actually it's the <clears throat> it's the horn so instead of using the horn from the surface when you are uh, submerge the horn can be used to uh, activate a uh, wave launch which uh, display the terrain while underwater uh, so I have a mod called clear water so I can see everything clear underwater but if you don't have that mod the water would be very muddy and not really able to see clearly so that function key will just uh, let you see underwater more clearly I guess it shows the mountains and the island and the uh, rocks that's surrounding you I suppose and I guess that's about it so can't wait to try these out if you have a thrasher right here uh, one of his recommendation is uh, reduce bulkhead which we are gonna actually add that now with this update uh, you get free dismount so actually you know what we're gonna dismount this for now and we're gonna see what happened if I was were to pick the torpedo tubes I know everyone love to have the torpedo more, uh, a lot more stronger so since uh, Thrasher doesn't recommend us to use the torpedo tube modification we're gonna find out why so let's see, we only, we only get one setting and that is the homing torpedo and it's maximum damage is 8100 which is a, uh, I think an upgrade right? I, I remember it being like 7600 but anyway if we were to add the torpedo 2 modification what do we get? we get 8700 about yeah that's uh not much difference <laughs> that's that is a uh 600 damage difference yeah not worth it at all so best you go with the uh reinforced uh bulkhead yeah and uh, what about this dive capacity you know what nah I went with the torpedo reload and I don't regret it. <laughs> A reload at 34 seconds, man. That's pretty damn fast. Alright, anyway, which one are we gonna take out? The, the Slasher or the Gato? You know what? We did try the Gato last time. Let's use the Slasher. How about that? Alright, so what I further do, let's uh, get on with the episode. So we do have a working main gun. As you can see right here. I mean, we can control it, is, is what I mean. Pretty cool. Five seconds. Seems legit. These dolphins are still swimming. Oh, not anymore. They left. Okay. <laughs> Excuse me. Alright, so I got three torpedoes in the back. And I got eight in the front. That is... That's crazy. Eight in the front. But this is a very slow submarine. 26 knots, that's it.
Alright, so we got the U4501 right here. What's my ping? 12 kilometers. They go about what? 78 knots. Okay. It's not bad. Alright, so we're gonna shotgun. Oh no, we can't shotgun him. That's hydro. Oh, they're gonna hit him? Come on. Crap, only two. We've sprung a leak. We're filling up fast. Come on, back to Pedos. Do your thing. Got that nation. Oh, that's awesome. Oh, they ain't for me. Torpedoes to port. Torpedoes to port. Oh, here we go. Torpedoes to port. Torpedoes direct front. Torpedoes to starboard. Oh my gosh. Oh shit, what was that? Do I have a 12 range or 13, 12? Okay. Damage control. Oh, he's done. That should kill him. Sucks. Torpedoes dead ahead. Torpedoes to port. Oh, they're fast. Can't we catch up? Well, well, that's because I'm underwater, idiot. <laughs> 
see that U4501 can go underwater real quick. It's 21 knots on the surface, but definitely underwater he goes like 30 knots or even 40. I don't know. It's ridiculous. Oh, there it is. As you can see, every time he pings, it shows its location. But of course, I already had a mod that tells me that. So if you don't have a mod, that's fine. It's going to show the same thing. <clears throat> so it's really nothing new. I mean, to me, that is. It's new to the people who, you know, who doesn't use mods. Alright, let's use it. Come to Papa. <clears throat> Get in there. I think he's gonna cancel it. Let's see. Yep. <clears throat> oh, come on. <clears throat> oh, yeah, he's dead. <clears throat> Man, my throat. Sorry about that, my throat is somehow somewhat very dry. But I'm still gonna upload the video regardless. <laughs> this is a pretty good uh, gameplay. Oh, we spotted. Ooh. It's Jimmy. He's right there. How the hell? I mean, this is a 26 knot submarine. It's definitely not gonna catch up to a 39 knots shimakaze. There it is. Oh, he's done. Oh. He repaired it. Alright, well. I guess that's it. I mean, I mean, we pretty much won this match. I don't know where the other Shimakazi go. He's not capping. I think he's gonna die before I can even launch any torpedoes. I'm just gonna... I don't know. Oh, look at that, we won. Sweet. Well, not too bad. I got that one kill. That's pretty, uh, crazy. 64 damage, yo. Yo, I harassed that GK. He's probably pissed. Nah, I'm not on top. Go figure. Well, that's gonna do it, guys. Thank you all for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please hit the like and subscribe button so I know you want to see more. Take care. See you later. Till next time.